both my brother and my father were open heart surgery, yes. And that was the problem with me, was that they didn't feel I could uh, survive it. There's no way I could do open heart, and Tabor was the only option. In my earlier, earlier life, I had a few bad experiences. I had a predisposition to stay away from doctors. Up until a few years ago, you know, he may not have had the option to get treated. But what Frank was able to get was a minimally invasive procedure that we do through the leg, and we drive a catheter up through the leg into the heart, and we very carefully position a valve and deploy a valve to replace the heart valve without cutting his chest open. Valve replacement was done, then all of a sudden it's boom like that. Oh, I had like a band-aid on on my thigh, and that was pretty much it. We've had really dramatic changes in the department since 2011. Uh, we started the TAVR program, Mitra Clip program, a left ventricular assist device program. Uh, we started putting in Watchmans. It's been a life-saving procedure, a life-changing procedure. That is a privilege. That is a unique opportunity that makes those hard, long hours worth it. It makes the time away from the family worth it. It's for a greater good, something bigger than myself. I'll be able to finish some things that I've been putting off for quite a while. <laughs> maybe focusing on being a better person as opposed to my career. These outcomes are being made more public. And as they're being made more public, it doesn't surprise me at all that we're starting to get very high rankings, the highest rankings possible in many different domains. I feel like I did when I was 40 now instead of, can't go all the way back to 20, but <laughs> we can go 35 or 40.